Science. Scientists at CERN have managed to trap elusive antimatter atoms for a quarter of an hour. It's a huge step forward on last year's efforts when they were able to hold the mysterious particles for just a fraction of a second. In the first trapping experiments, we just held on to the atoms for 172 milliseconds. So the big breakthrough now is that we've held on to these antimatter atoms for up to 1,000 seconds. We have enough time to study antimatter in our laboratory here at CERN. Antimatter is the mirror image of matter, identical but with an opposite electrical charge, and destroys each other when they meet. Our universe is apparently made entirely of matter, yet at the time of the Big Bang, matter and antimatter would have existed in equal quantities. Particle physics labs like CERN in Switzerland can make antimatter easily enough, but it's proved almost impossible to hang on to and study because it instantly annihilates on contact with regular containers made of normal matter. The antiprotons from the antiproton decelerator, that's the machine that we need here at CERN, come down this pipe right here. And they come into our apparatus, which is inside this large magnet. This is a very strong magnetic field to help to confine the charged particles that make antihydrogen. Scientists are now working on trapping more antiatoms at a time, and in doing so, hope to find out why nature favored matter over antimatter at the dawn of the universe.